Tuesday, Tuesday, up, Tuesday. Didn't get anything out of that one out of you, Adam. I think we should make that a like a ritual that we get a little bit of singing out of you every day. <laughs> it's Toasty shooting me all these uh, sick songs. Shout out to Toasty, like Boasty. Toasty the DJ. Gems, yeah, I didn't hear any. Gems. I didn't hear any singing from Adam. I'm kind of disappointing. Sorry, guys. For me, for me. It's always gets worse. Um, always gets worse uh, the longer the week goes. It's only Tuesday. <laughs> it's Alpha Tuesday. Alpha Tuesday, huh? The heck. I wonder who won with this wild. Market. Definitely not me. I don't think so. <laughs> No, I don't think it was me either. I think mine went. I think I mine went down too. I know who won. I think so. I got a double shake at full price, but we have a winner. We have a winner. But that's not. Uh, yes, today we're going to give away a uh, Vogue Legends. I just secured a Saint on the floor uh, this morning uh, that we're going to give away. And the funny thing is, I shake the thing, it pumped like. Half a soul since this morning? Yeah. Did you get it at like 1.2, 1.3 something this morning? I, I think I started the trend. <laughs> Did that thing do this flow? Yeah, because they were up to like 1.8 or something a little bit ago. Yeah, it's 1.8. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Wow. Let's see if we can get some people in here. Um, I'm going to retweet the space. Yeah, I made that the, the um, what's it called? Criteria for enter. Uh, we can get some people in here. Let me shoot some invites as well. Um, how are you doing, Peter? Great, great. Just having some coffee. It's still kind of early here. Well, not that much, but it's still coffee time. How are you? I'm good, I'm good. I'm having coffee as well, but it's not early. But... Uh, it's good with a nice brew. Uh, anyway, yes, it's Aptos craziness. We just woke up our uh, whitelist hunter, so the Discord is uh, coming alive for sure. Uh, gonna shoot some Aptos <laughs> whitelist for us. We actually have a very good, I guess, track record or, or success rate in getting. I think it's because well, uh, we we offer the mates as well, right, to come on the pod. So we usually get some good whitelist. So Victoria have been shooting whitelists already we'll see if we can get some good ones um yeah it's crazy i hopefully i hope we can have some i added so we can uh, do either apple chain solana chain cardano or ethereum so i hope we have someone who shares any aptos space even though there isn't a lot on that uh, market right now the, the the most of the things is coming in week i still think there could be some winners to come on on aptos that's already minted. My friends, we got some people at least. Uh, I pinned the tweet. Uh, go shoot the, the retweet to be eligible to win this Tokyo. Uh, I'm going to cover the, the <laughs> rules. I tried to make some rules um, for today. So it's somewhat fair to give away this NFT. We had the Reddit NFTs yesterday, right? I yeah I should yeah it. yeah Reddit NFTs apparently have been a, well they're not NFTs they're called digital collectibles. But it's been a thing. It's not an actual NFT. Yeah, they don't want to use the right word. <laughs> but that's because they hate NFTs, right? Like I've been on Reddit. I usually read like Reddit in the morning just to go through uh, cryptocurrency, like just see what's happening on there. <laughs> they always hate the NFTs. So I'm happy to see them buying <laughs> NFTs. Or digital collectibles. But I checked the volume yesterday. It was 1.2 million uh, volume in the first 24 hours. So I yeah, uh, hope to see some of those people uh, join us in the real space. Good. Guys. Uh, they will not like that you called crypto Twitter the real space and Reddit the fake space. Um, that's a good way to engagement fund. I mean, I may, uh, Steal that and uh, attack some red people later. See if see if I can engage my farm off that post. Appreciate I'm gonna it. go post. I'm gonna go post a recording of me saying that in the on on Reddit. Uh, yeah, 
let's see. Uh, guys, uh, if you have any place or if you want to win this, Tokyo, come up on stage. We're going to have one. Ah, oh, fuck, let's not do the rules, but uh, I'm going to cover the rules soon. Um, what's up, Jiraiya? What's up, what's up? I like to enter, enter in your contest. I retweet it. I liked. I like to give one that'll go up next Tuesday. Um, meta tattoo. Wait, 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 wait. Oh. We're, close. We're gonna take the call. Oh, wow, dude. <laughs> Come on. I'm at work. I, I don't have time to do it at a specific time. This is my entry. This is my entry. All right, all right. You're right. Shoot. Okay, okay. Let's start it. Let's start it. You're right. Shoot your. Okay, so uh, quickly, quickly. Uh, it has to be secondary. Uh, it has to be on Apple's Ethereum, um, Solana, or Cardano. Meta tattoo uh, club. I took it from everybody else. They can't use that anymore. Okay, so why why do you think uh, meta tattoo is is good? Um, besides that, it's on the two major chains that people care about, ETH and Solana. It's just on Solana right now. Um, yeah, it's, it's the most decent art we've seen in the last six weeks. Everything else has been shit. Um, their founders are present. Um, I'll tell you something I've noticed, um, that's actually made me super bullish. They, they're active as fuck on Twitter and not just one space. Uh, they do hella spaces, uh, not just one team member. They have hella team members who are active. And, uh, after man, I thought they were going to go quiet with their hype. But they've only continued with it, and I think they're gonna doing a good job at keeping that momentum going. So uh, everybody's holding. Apparently, it. sitting at a five sole floor price too. Yeah, bro. So I'm a bit. It's a bullish. solid one. It's a solid entry. All right, he already snagged the meta tattoo. Uh, good. I'm gonna take. I'm, fuck, you're too early, dude. I'm gonna take a snapshot right now of because since we have four chains, it has to be. Uh, USD value, right? But it's going to me- be measured in percentage accre- increase as always. Uh, so uh, let's take a snapshot of the prices right now. So 31.98 ETH, if we have any of those. Uh, 14.79 ADA 0.41 Four point four, all right, and then we have Apt as well. Aptos is going to be funny to call because that token might do just a increase or decrease, just a token. Eight point nine three, eight point nine three, perfect. Tony, uh, we're going to take your call very soon. I'm just going to start this whole fuck, guys. You're hungry as fuck. What the heck? Uh, let's start it. They're let's ready, start. Adam. Uh, no, sorry, yeah. Adam. It wasn't. It wasn't a call. Um, it was just an observation. That <laughs> all, all, observation. all the okay. coins are up ten. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the fucking the market, market. You... <laughs> No. Yeah, bull <laughs> market's coming. Tony's been calling it. I love to hear it. Tony's calling the bull market for next week. That's his call, right? The whole bull market. <laughs> You said I'll November, Tony, but we're starting. Are you still? It's November, the, the bull market, or is it starting already? What do you think? You just seeing that. Adam, 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 we asked yesterday, where the fuck? Who the fuck? What the fuck? Who's buying a billion dollars? What the fuck? Now you right. see those numbers printing. There was a lot I mean, of money going into like, the ecosystem. I, I usually, I know we shouldn't trade on feelings, but you can kind of feel the. You know, when you're starting to see these news, like we had the UK prime minister yesterday, you're starting to see these things like on the TV, they talk about crypto. Like there is a little bit of, uh, it's a little bit, the vibes, the vibes, dude, it's coming. Thumbs There's, down, thumbs down, thumbs down. If you're, if you're not feeling those vibes, when you see someone who has a billion dollars to play with, deciding to play a game with this digital money, you should just follow their play because um, they're going to pump it regardless. <laughs> Let's see, but you have been doing this, so uh, I wouldn't mind a, a little November bull run, especially in NFTs. What do you, right. what do you mean? How are people... Look, 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 look this is this, the pessimism that will kill the market. Your entire bags on everything is up right now. Not by 1%. Not by 2%. You know, if you... If you put a thousand dollars in yesterday, you are one thousand one one thousand one hundred fifty dollars up right now on Solana. Like you can't earn that in a low, in a high street bank. We need to we need to lose this sentiment of 
oh, what's a pump? 15% shoot from zero to 15%. That is a pump right there. Like, that is a pump. If you if you want a 260, that's you're talking about 300, 400x, you know? Like, but if you want to say, what's a pump? That's a pump. A 15% move north is a flipping pump. Today, today, I want to see 30%. This is not over, bro. This is not over. The, the move is just starting. Now, I was just with Kalos and those guys in their spaces, and Kalos and those guys were getting a hype, bro. They were getting a hype. They rolled this to 20. Bro, um, November the 1st. No, you you can just save all, save all this. Tell me what you need to buy, Tony. Just tell me what you want us to buy. I'm calling it bull market, bro. Just buy anything. Just buy anything. Like the shortest call is the bull market. Flip it, dude. I can't. I cannot believe this. I just checked the. the I just cross checked the pumps from last week's calls. Hmm. I cannot believe what I'm seeing, guys. I cannot believe what I'm seeing. It's an emergency. It's an emergency in the pod space right now, guys. <laughs> is everything down that we called? Down bad central. If you stay tuned till the end of the show. We'll tell you what coin to buy. <laughs> oh, no, I forgot. Right 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 blowing pump. everything out of the water. I forgot. Oh, wait, wait, wait. You want you want me to call something? I want I want something to buy. You want me to call something right now? Write it down, paper, scratch it down. No, 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 no. Okay, okay. so here, here's what you're going to say anymore, but I'm going to say it. Panthers right now. I'm calling it right now. Go. Go. Do you know? Do you know that that if you can only make one call today, and that is going to be your, or you can make several, but you have to stick to the one you you call. That is going to be your. No, that's the one. That's my call. one. That's my one. Panthers. What's the that's one you said? Panthers. <clears throat> All right, let, let's let's start this shit and let's get it going, and and then Tony can give us a. You're gonna be first, uh, uh, apart from Jiraiya, who, who was already on it. But uh, Adam, so, Adam, so, can so. we pause real quick and just has everyone looked at Solana and ETH right now? Yeah, it's all up ten percent. That's what Tony was just saying. Dude, when I told everyone to buy in the fear the past couple days, when everything was in the twenties and down, and now. When everyone was saying, oh, we're going to feel max pain. Things are going down. Everything's going down. Guys, the world's going to an end. Look at it. Up 15% today. Bitcoin over 20K. My, I'll move so my yield. back over $30. You know the funds I used to yield on my loaned NFTs? I moved that back to Solana at 28, I think, or 27. I'm pumped right now, bro. <laughs> when are you taking profit? Are you going to hold something? We're going to the moon, Adam. We're going to, uh, fast pit stop the moon, and then I might take profits before we go to Mars. That's it, you know, forty-two dollars. But yeah, that's what that's it, you know. <laughs> oh, I love it. Yeah, let's see. Uh, I trust you, Tony. Uh, buy some salami, or no, you should have bought salami uh, because we're taking off, baby. But now we start this. First, we're gonna start with last week's calls. We had some winners. We had Tokyo Saints. Who increased to what? One point from one? No, I'm not going to do all the numbers. But Tokyo Saints increasing price. Uh, more beers increasing price. Uh, degenerate monkeys increasing price. And Sharky increasing price. So we had some winners yesterday. That, uh, no, yesterday. Last week. Um, so that's good to see because we have seen in general, I think, a decline in the market. But uh, some winners. And uh, the drone. The best call of the week. And this week's top caller. Goes two. Are you ready? James. Whoop. I don't know, guys. Can I say it? Sesti Degen 36. What is it? I can't believe what I'm seeing. What the heck? What? Degenerate monkey. No, not that one. Yeah, that one's loud. I am Don't. shaking right now. I am shaking. Point and I'm, shaking with, He's one I'm, I'm shaking with you. I'm, I've got a better... Uh, That's a hat uh, I'm doing better here than I am on my uh, fantasy football. Thank you, Tony. You are correct. It's a hat trick. I feel like Messi or Ronaldo. Ooh. Goal number three. You should have seen how that goal got taken well. 
Yes, sir. I'm tipping my hat to you. Can't believe it. Can't believe it. I'm going to buy whatever it says to says today. That's I'm a real cowboy, it. baby. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. You know, I, so, just, uh, I know how to pick them. I'm, 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 I, might, I might follow you on that, Adam. I got, I got, I got some change right now. But I... Hey, y'all. You know what? What else can I say? I wake up and I piss excellent. You know, if you ain't first, you're last. <laughs> Uh, so, Sesti, if you take the the fort, uh, you're gonna win a. Uh, unfortunately, you didn't win anything apart from the throne. But there, uh, if you win this week for the fourth time, you're gonna get a Tokyo. So, uh, hold on to that throne, baby. Let's start it. Welcome, guys. We're gonna host our usual Alpha Tuesday. Um, it's a special episode today because for the past three weeks we have been doing this this Alpha Tuesday, which has been, in my opinion, a lot of fun. Um, so we thought, why not spice it up a little, a little extra today? So we're gonna give away this Tokyo Saints, sitting at one point eight salami, which is what 50, 50 bucks. So a little bit spice. Um, yeah. So for you guys here right now, it means uh, that you are eligible. If you go to the pub, click on retweet, come up on stage, share and play, you're eligible to win this, and it's gonna be announced next week. And if you're listening to the recording, I'm sorry, you cannot win. But, but the people here has to think a little bit today. So there might be some good, good plays uh, for you guys listening to the recording. The rules is simple, but I'll try to make it super clear. As I said, go to the pin tweet, click on that little rotating thing, make it green. And during the next hour or two, come up on stage. And once you're ready, raise your hand and we'll uh, name drop uh, the project you want to call. I will go and check the price. We've already taken the snapshot, the uh, USD prices for the tokens. So come up on stage, name drop the project, and I will we'll go and check the floor price and write it down. Also, please give us a quick little spill why you think it's a good buy so we're not only <laughs> getting a blind name. One call per person, to make it fair, Ethereum, Cardano, Aptos, Solano, Measured in USD value from now, with the current prices I give you run out of the four. It's going to be measured in percentage increase, and and one hour before the next Tuesday pod, which is one PM EST, first of November. It has to be live on secondary, so no means. I think you guys realize why this makes more sense. And lastly, no bullshit connection, which basically means there has to be some volume and some listing. I guess bullshit collections would be like Poogles or Enigma, which has two listings and no, ah, they have volume, but, but no. if they get one sale, it, it's game over. So it has to at least have some volume and some sale and be above like, it has to be ha have a floor price above a few pennies because otherwise, you know, you'll make a 10x if you, if you hit. Yes, so that's it. That's the rule. Don't stress it. We're just here to have some fun and win some prizes. It's supposed to be fun. It might be better to go early because uh, your uh, calls might be stolen if you wait for too long. Who's first? We have Jiraiya calling uh, mm, 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 Tattoo Club, Meta Tattoo Club already. So that one is taken. Five souls. Tony, uh, you maybe you can go first. You have you name dropped it, but uh, yeah, go for it. Thank you, thank you. That's awesome. I'm going to buy that. <laughs> Tony, That's are you a good one? one? Yes, not. Tony, if you don't drop your, your collection right now, someone can just steal it. Yeah? Right, you oh. steal it. Oof, man, fuck you. Yeah. I was talking too much. Uh, someone want to have a... Go. I have mine ready, but uh, I'm gonna wait. Who wanna go? I'll go. Give me one second here. Feel free, future. It looked like Sofo on you. Did like he was gonna? Did you got something there, Sofo? Yeah. Oh wait, no, future, right? go. I was oh, gonna say I saw uh, Kami. I'm. No, Tony, you're okay. No. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, uh, and I'm gonna lose service here soon. So. 
Not totally. totally, totally, totally. You'll, you'll get the second one. Future, do you have connection? Yeah, I do right now, I think. Oh, God, you can go for any connection. All right. It's, gonna, it's just going to be quick. The uh, What I saw this morning was Commuter 3 was at 19 Seoul, and that is and has been a very reputable project. So I honestly think that this is a dip that someone could get in on. Uh, they do a whole lot. Like, their nation is crazy. And, yeah, I mean, they're, they've planted themselves as an established project in the ecosystem. So everybody, for the most part, knows about Community 3 on Solana. So Community 3 is a mad scientist, right? Yeah, I mean, I'm looking at the bots, the big whatever, the big uh, Community 3 bots. But, yeah, they, they are connected. Community 3 mad scientist. Sitting at twenty point one. Right? Do you have you? You were so short. You're usually going for long. Future. You do you have a? What, do you think it's something that is going to happen in like a week of it? I just don't think that that's viable for them to sit there. Like I said, I saw it at nineteen this morning, and they were on the trending. So they've definitely come up from you know. I, I would assume it wouldn't have been crazy low, but maybe seventeen, eighteen, at the lowest. Um, but yeah, I mean, I just think we've seen them on a lot higher. If you go back on their you go back on the research entry for a project that you know offers a lot of value. So if you look, you know, I, I know I'd like to go into it, but I'm I'm literally rolling up to an area that I'm. Yeah, you're already starting to cut in and out there, bud. So. Yeah. Well, that is Future's call with Commune 3 for the week. I've heard a lot about them. I've almost bought that many times. Many, many, many times. They're so secretive. Like, that that's what I don't get. We need to have them on the pub. I've been talking to them, and we haven't secured it. We need to have them on there. Because if you go, like, I've been going on the website, going to Discord, and everyone's just super uh, bullish on it. But there is no, like, clear, okay, so what do I actually get if I pay 20 soul for this? I need to have them on there. I would love that. I would absolutely love that. Right, right. Uh, community 3, 4, 20, so perfect. Uh, thanks, future. Tony, are you ready? He's not in. Nope, he's not a listener at the moment. He was going in and out of connection, too. What is going on with the connection today? All right. I'll just jump in then while everyone else is having a connection issues. Projects out there, Yo, degenerates. Okay. So yeah, not everybody's familiar with this project. They've been around for some time. Please don't ask me to dissect and go into the projects. I won't know what to say about them. All I know is they're a bunch of degenerates. You can't miss them. You'll see them in most timelines, and it's the cats. They're currently sitting at twenty point five, and I think I've only seen them there once before in the last month. And um, yeah, if they, you they talking probably about will... the cats on crack. Kets on crack. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And, um, yeah, I think we're just one or two bullish news from their side. That, that that should pump. I mean, you're most likely to see that above the 30 floor price. So that's my only one. And, um, yeah, I'm waiting to see what happens next week. Mm. I'll be very surprised if they come below. I would be very surprised if they hit that 15 mark or, or lower. And I'm, I'm sure, TK, you're feeling the same sentiment. I think uh, any of these like quality collections could be because we're having this Aptos thing, right? Everyone is selling and buying Aptos and aping and blah, 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 blah. Eventually, probably this is going to calm down and we can hopefully see some liquidity flow into these quality products again. Um, so the cat's at 20.5. Do you know, do they have anything upcoming or are you speculating? No, 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 nothing upcoming, no news. I actually had two in mind. This was one of them, and the other one, uh, our good friend Tony's got it as a PFP. It's just the market sentiment and just looking at what's been happening in the, in the, in the market in the past week or two, just knowing that everybody's in utter fear at the moment. No one wants to trade. Floor prices are just dumping. And um, yeah, that's it. So just going from, as you've mentioned, Adam, feelings. You shouldn't be going with feelings. I, I'll get that feeling anyway. Right, right. Kits twenty point five. Let's see. 
what Pablo got in store for next week. Right. Uh, we're having quality. I like uh, we're having quality calls. It's not the usual point zero zero one things we buy. Anyone else feel feel uh, ready? What you got for us, Adam? Uh, I was curious to see see yours. I think there's two ways to play this. Either you can gamble on something like very cheap that can have because imagine like like Sesti uh, last week called the degenerate monkeys, uh, or you go on something a little bit more, I guess, expensive or established that has something upcoming. I don't know much about this video, so I'm gonna have to take a something I know. Uh, the, the so I, I was looking, I was searching for it for for what I know. Now I was choosing between Lutus Gang, they have the upcoming collection, right? They have been starting to drop a lot of stuff. But the simpler also ABC. I wanna see. I, I thought you were called ABC too. It looked like you got some DJ play for us. Ghost Kids have their roadmap 3.0 coming up, right? And also, we know for a fact that Shane Bacon's got a lot of stuff. So I, I would uh, not be surprised if I see someone called Shane Bacon. But that would be too easy. So I'm going to go with something more. Um, what I say? Stupid. Stupid as fuck. Uh, it's sitting at 90 soul. I'm playing it safe. And... Uh, Hopefully none of, none of you guys call one of the DJ plays that goes 10x. And it's going to be biased. But I know a lot about this product, which is why I think I'm pretty sure on this one. And it's called BSL, Blocked with Labs. Uh, first off, they have teased. They have teased for a, a long time that the art upgrade is going to be in the end of this month. So I check the dates. End of month is, yeah, like now until next Monday. So if that happens, okay, so some might, might speculate that it's going to dump on the announcement on Art Upgrade. But I don't think so. We've been waiting for too long. Those, those, those guys are already out. They sold. Uh, so I think it's going to pump if that announcement comes. Um, and if that, if, so uh, it might be delayed, right? Like everything else. But my, my parachute is that these guys have been, uh, we're having the Apple hype right now, we already confirmed that. Which I think will sustain this week because there is so much launching on there right now. So I think that the Apple's hype is going to sustain. And this is honestly the only product on Solana taking advantage of that because for them, they have the Mercury, right? Which is wallet collection. All the good product on Apple's right now is doing wallet collection on Mercury, which means if you hold a blocksmith, you have guaranteed, no, not guaranteed, but almost guaranteed whitelist for these uh, projects. So if, when this app starts pumping on these projects, uh, people are going to realize, oh, fuck, I could have had all of these. Like, for example, the Apto Mingos. That was free mint. Uh, the blocksmith had whitelist. So it's basically free 150 Aptos uh, for just holding this thing. This summer, when this happened with, like, OK Beers and all of those projects, they went to 100, I think, 160. Uh, so it's a bet. That, that's the parachute if this art upgrade doesn't come. Um, if the art upgrade comes, it might be like 50%. If not, I think maybe 20, 30. So hopefully you guys don't pull a, a 10x on here. Uh, but it's basically high weight for them on the Aptos right now. So we'll see. Um, bias the fuck. I think it's going to go. Hmm. Apple Mingos might be a good one as well. Just when I talked about it. I heard that the founder is crazy. But I'm not going to call it. But, okay, so uh, BSL, that's my call. Let me show uh, Short price. I to have something more fun, but I cannot, I cannot do it yet. 91.5. Oh my God, he has me pumping. Oh my God. 91.5. Let's see. Uh, right, that's mine. Who feels ready? We have some new people joining us as well. It's uh, nothing crazy, guys. Just go on the tweet above, retweet it, come up on stage, raise your hand, call a project you think is going to increase in price over a week, and the winner gets a token of the same. Thanks. Uh, 
Who's ready? So, Who's ready? I don't know. I've, I've been torn on two. I've been torn on two. Um, you mentioned one being chain breakers, and the other ones that I think is a really good price at 265 Solana. And you all know what that is. Yeah. Tie robots. If, if, if you look at Utes at 120 and D Gods are only at 265, the ratio doesn't make sense. Either the D Gods are underpriced at the moment or the Utes are way overpriced. And with them sitting, they've, they've stayed practically over 100, the Ute, Ute tubes. And I mean, if you can get a God under 250, I mean, I really think it's a good deal. All time high was what, 600? I'm not saying that Utes are going to reveal this week, but if they did, I would win this bet like no other. Um, but I really think a D got around that, that low 200s. I really think that is a good price for those. What is that? Eight grand? Uh, yeah, exactly. Yeah, so I mean, and they've been 20. So, I mean, it's, it, it may be, it may dip a little more, but with everything coming back and I've, I've, I've heard Frank talk a couple of times this week. I'm I'm going to put my my bet on the D guys that from 265 next week they'll be more expensive and it'll be a big jump. I'm checking the price. I can't fuck my pen is off. 265 is the four. <laughs> well, we're gonna have some. We need some whales listening to this if they're gonna be able to to buy anything. I know, uh, but I mean, with the zero percent royalties on a D God right now, I've been talking to a lot of my ETH buddies, telling them, man, if y'all want to get in, there's no better time than right now. And if you're listening in this recorded space, um, with the zero percent royalties and the zero percent um, mark marketplace um, fee being with, I mean, a month ago, D Gods had nine point nine percent plus two percent on Magic Eden. But do you really think? Are you really like bullish that D Gods are still long term? Like they've got nothing but yes. like kind of like wooden flags that like, they're not going to be long term. Like a community around Frank. Now, how long is that sustainable? With you, um, Frank being irresponsible with deadlines and promises the community. Um, the art has to match the hype. Three, four months of hype. It's kind of big, you know. So, in your opinion, you think they're still on the rise? You don't think they're on the way down? No, I, I I think this is about the bottom. I mean, they've they hit that that low lower two hundreds. And then they've bounced back up to above 250. I really don't see him going down that. There's there's people accumulating. There's people that believe in Frank. I mean, he's been here from the beginning. And, I mean, you can like it or hate it. But, I mean, with, at that price and no royalties and no marketplace, how do you not save yourself that extra $700, $800? Take dust out of the picture. What What's the value of you got? But you can't. You can't take dust out of the picture. Dust comes with the D gods, and until their their staking is done at the end of the year, you know that's that's when you'll see a big, big price change, in my opinion. But now, I think you'll be all right. Ooh, let's see. Let's see what D gods can accomplish in a week. Isabel is uh, supporting that call. I see. Yes, she is super supportive of all of my calls. She normally is. I'm waiting for her to come up here and tell us her call. I don't think so. So, so these these are the rules. We got even more people joining us. Come up on stage, share something you think is going to increase in price uh, in the next week. Uh, the best call gets a token thing next Tuesday. Um, yes. All right. So we have Meta Tattoo, Community Three, Kets, Bell, and D Gods. Expensive thing. You guys are expensive. expensive. It's, an, it's an expensive week. There's, there's not really been any cheaper I'm calls. I'm waiting on the system. I've got you, right. babies. I got you. I'm just waiting to see if anybody else wants to hop up. I'm giving opportunities. I'm giving you a chance well, to go he ahead. He said, and run three weeks in a row. He said, I ain't even worried about you guys picking what I'm going to pick. <laughs> and Isabel, come up oh. here and make a call. And hopefully it was Zesty. <laughs> I, we welcome one and all, please. It, uh, again, the rules are um, take a play you feel confident in that might pump up. And if you win 
Uh, next week you get a Tokyo Saint, a High Rise Saint, a High Rise Saint. Um, but if no one else is going, oh yeah, um, I do have a call. But can you guys hear me? Oh, my bad. Go ahead, Mutual. No, no, uh, sir, we can. We're gonna go ahead and really. kick you back down to listener. Now we can. No, look. Okay, look real quick. There's another one. That's one you call. Can only, you can only make one. Call. You get one call. Well, he rugged anyways. Uh, must have been Sissy. feel because of the project. All right. So I say, if anybody wants to do their honor honorable mentions, if we have time, Adam, maybe at the end of the show, they just don't count. If anybody wants to pay uh, play yeah. with those, cool. But uh, I also have been torn, TK. Um, three projects I have had my eye on. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and risk it all. I'm going all in here. I'm giving you, everyone here in this space today, to get an opportunity to kick me off my throne because this is a long shot, a real long shot. I don't give a shit. I'm a long shot, too. And someone's stuck by me, and we've made it out the mud. Let's go. All right, so here we go. The Descendants, baby. The Descendants. I am calling the Descendants. Yes, they are getting, they've been kicked around. They've been going through some time oil, but legitimately the project is still, it still has a chance. There's still an opportunity to be had here. Um, the project still has its original plans, although they have changed and there's some different avenues they're looking to take to continue with this project. The original roadmap is still intact. And that basically is, this originally was an artist, right? An artist by the name of Blue Boss is who created the collection. And it's the PFP I'm currently wearing. Um, as of now, there are three total collections. The original collection is called The Ancestors. Um, there's a cameo by my baby, if you can hear him in the background. Um, is a 100-piece collection. Uh, that 100-piece collection had pumped up to quite... A, uh, a nice floor price. Uh, I believe it got to 100, uh, definitely in the 50s, above 25, basically, right? For um, unique one-of-one -one art. A few of us here in this space now, uh, or in the pod community, uh, may still hold the original Ancestors. The Descendants, which is the PFP that I'm wearing, is the second collection. And then the third is called the Lost, Lost Descendants, which currently you're able to buy off secondary and also win by sending your Descendants on missions. Now, Getting back to the alpha. Ancestors, if you own one, because of all this revenue shit, um, all of the um, the uh, Magic Eden doing its its thing, you know, taking away royalties, uh, Ancestors have gotten down to a very viable price point, a very lovely price point. The Ancestors give you rev share from all the sales that the descendants are having. Um, although you may not see the floor moving much, there are sales happening um daily and pretty often uh, i picked up a few in the past few days um second they are at an incredibly low price point uh these guys had gotten to like a three floor price originally maybe a little bit higher than that um when they first popped off uh they're down to about 0.37 if you want to pay royalties maybe a little bit higher if you don't you can scoop them up at 0.37 um, throw a couple offers out there, see what happens. I think this project still has potential. One of their plans is moving the Lost Descendants collection over to Arbitrum. Yeah, I don't know how we feel about that as a community, but they're looking to go cross-chain as well, right? Um, as they continue, um, the Descendants at one point will start to also receive rev share from sale of the Lost Descendants. Um, like I said, it's a long shot. Floor is low and thin. Amazing art. It's fucking beautiful. I have quite a few pieces. Go take a look. See if you dig it. One of a, one of one art is going to be coming in heavy as everyone loves to throw the word around the new meta. Um, and once royalties come back, man, all these projects are going to start popping off again. Um, this could be an easy... Um, no, let me rephrase that. It may not be the easiest flip, but with a little bit of hype behind it, um, some solid holders getting back into the community, getting into that Discord and building the hype again because they did roll deep uh, in Discord. They definitely still roll pretty deep. I can attest to that. Um, should I, should I we can get some bumps. We can get some bumps. Yes, sir. I, I see you're rocking the December 50, right? Are you in, yes. in that Discord? No. So let me go ahead and show you why I'm more bullish. They kicked me the fuck out. Why? Because I was flooding them. I was in there just... <laughs> 
<laughs> in my own bags just to see how they handle it. And they get, you know, they see the toxicity and they kicked it out. Um, I'm going to be making my way back in, making my way downtown, faces past. Um, anyways, um, that's a little something for the Spotify crowd. Um, anywho, I'm going to get back in there. We're going to get the hype going. I just, I dig the art, man. I fucking love it. Y'all go check it out yourselves. People are rocking squiggly lines and you can't tell me you don't love the art I'm rocking. It is sick. It is sick. Uh, all right. So this is uh, controversial, uh, controversial and a little bit risky, I guess. But by the fun, that works in the past, right? We'll see, Sassy. Sassy but it's fuel, baby. But it's fuel. That's, That's why there's degenerate in my name. Also, yeah, I forgot to uh, say, guys, uh, it doesn't have, have to be like these uh, guys here uh, on stage right now is usually on Solana. I guess that, that's why there is a lot of uh, Solana products. But we're also doing ETH, Aptos, um, ETH, Aptos, ADA, uh, Cardano, and Solana. So if you have uh, calls on another chain, feel free. You have nothing to lose and a token sync to win. Perfect. I think I've been calling TK, Uriah, Toasty. Uh, do you have any place for the week? I was actually going to go with Zetsu's pick, but uh, so I got a little screwed there. <laughs> no way, for real? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was no floor price. I mean, you know, it deserves to be around definitely above mint, which is 0.6. So. It's a great project. See, another, another community member. There's a few. Oh, I met you. You even met first. Uh, I did. But uh, as TK as TK so famously says, I was working. <laughs> but uh, so you have some time to find something else. Go check your bags and shit it. No, no, dude, don't shit your bags. We're here to make Wait, money. Who did, who did TK take? Who did TK take actually? It took a sheep. This is like a kind of DJ one. Uh, um, sheep, Solana uh, rug. Like it's called Digots. <laughs> uh, shoot. He took D gods. Okay, I'm going to go opposite and just say use. Ooh. Just to make it interesting. Can I do that? Yes, of course. Of course. Okay, so let me check the price of Utes and then you have to tell me. Why I think Utes is a good buy at 116.4 Solana? I think they're a good buy because I don't think they're going to reveal anytime soon. Everyone knows that when a project reveals, they take a little dip. And I don't think they're going to reveal. And Solana's pumping right now. So I think they're going to get a pump as well. That's my piece. Very simple. They've been fun as well. Same thing there, like like these these people that wanted to get out of mutes because of the fun, they should be out at this point because those guys are wasting them. I think there might be some anticipation stuff coming from Frank, maybe. Just maybe. These are these are I think Sesti, you have the best you know, it's much easier. Like, how, how much further can they use? Maybe they can go to, like, 200, but that's, like, 2x. Like, just this call go 10x if they do something. But we'll have some concert calls here. Playing it safe. <clears throat> All right, good one. Utes. Let's see. Dude, imagine they just pulled a reveal right now. GG. Well, I, yeah, Utes revealing will probably be when the bull market seems like it's back on. <laughs> that's the sad part. That's what I feel. But uh, just quickly, Adam, uh, not because of whatever, um, I really do believe if the Ghost Kids 3.0 roadmap comes out, hopefully, based on what we've been hearing and all that, it might come out short. We're going to do, and it might hype it up to at least doubling its floor price, in my opinion. So I'm going to go ahead and call Ghost Kids. Hopefully the roadmap comes out in the next few days or a week. I think they're sitting at six point two or something like that right now, which has been a resistance. They haven't really gone down under that for a while, so I think they six point three five. Yeah, 
Do you have any so insights? You're a ghost kid yourself. Do you have any like, no. insights on the? I wish I did. I wish I did. I just know they've been having more meetings, discussing it, and they're working on it. And uh, I'm just thinking maybe by the end, the first of the month or the end of the month, uh, there'll be some news on what they're going to be doing with roadmap 3.0. And they one thing I know is they have always made some game changing stuff especially with like the booties and rate to earn stuff like that. So we will see. We will see. Yeah, they have these days. We have to ask Task, dude, when this uh, roadmap, we literally, we have to ask him, Task, we talk to him a lot. When is this roadmap? Because this feels like a myth at this point. There's no roadmap right. coming. <laughs> That's what I'm thinking. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to get sliding in DM, see if I can get any more information. But this is without knowing anything inside that's what i think so um you were there when the roadmap 2.0 dropped uh how yes. much did they increase on that uh drop uh they went times five and then when the fomo kicked in they went more uh in the next like two three days after that so i think they were at two point I think they were like 1.8 to 2 right before the 2.0 map dropped. And then uh, they went to 3, 4, 5, came back to f around 3.5, and then shot up to 10 within like a day or two. Um, so they did a 4, 5x right off the bat. And then I think the all-time high was at 25, about a week and a half after the roadmap 2.0. Have they teased anything what's going to be on the roadmap 3? You know? No, not at all. Not not that I know of um, checking through. they just been teasing about discussing uh, details on it. That's about it. They haven't said anything. I just I, I was talking to Task or something, and he had said that they just had a meeting about the, you know, the roadmap 3.0. That's it. He wouldn't tell me much more at that last time. Right, right, let's see. Let's see. Um, Ghost Kid at 6.35. Let's see hey. if Super Odie can take the drone. Hello. From Sesti. Hello, I'm so, okay, mate, I'm so sorry. Yeah, I just need help transferring funds from my Phantom wallet to, uh, like, how can I withdraw it, please? I'm just. Wrong space, bro. <laughs> but, but go to Biden. Yeah, I'm just stuck, bro. Literally, I'm trying to find you. Literally, but I've just been trying to transfer it like for the past twenty minutes. I've got like twenty quid in there, and I'm just trying to get it out. But <laughs> you know, know, you asked us this question what? yesterday. Bro. <laughs> oh, swear, yo, this yo, is... yo, this is so, crazy, boy. Yo, yo, nah, you've been so pulling hard. the same trick on everybody. Yeah, again, bro, nah. because you know what? Look, you how, about, is, how, about, yeah, how about you give right us some now, alpha? Yeah, give us some alpha. You wouldn't even believe it. Yeah, I created a whole new. Um, I created a whole new. What you call it? A Coinbase account, and then I basically set up like everything, gave them all my details. And now, like, I tried transferring the funds, and then it came, it came through to the second account, but after, I just wasn't able to just, like, uh, like withdraw it into my account, but it was just a headache, and that's why I thought I'd come back on here, see if I can get any more answers. Um, um, just send me your seed phrase, I got you. Um, no, but is... what you can do in the meantime, if you have any alpha on a project you're looking at, doesn't matter the blockchain, go ahead, drop it right now. One project you're bullish on. Um... To be fair, like I haven't I haven't really been looking, but I was, I was thinking um, probably has to be the um, yeah, mate. To be fair, like I don't want to just give you like a straight answer because I'm not I'm not really sure to be honest. You got uh, three more seconds. It's a Tokyo Saints for two Solana sitting on on the drone here. You got three more seconds. Yeah, mate. I'm just so lost. So wait, wait, wait. Can you, can you just explain that? Three. Two. Yeah, just send me your seed phrase. I admit was one. Time's up. Sorry, my friend. Peter, do you have any place for it? Um. Well, I yeah, I was gonna call it the two guys, but uh, it's already been called. Um. So aside from that, um, I would probably. I'm just throw. Yeah, I'm I'm going to throw their one. Uh, just because they're the low right now, I think this is a bottom for them or close to bottom, and it's super easy to go up. 
um, which it's actually uh, the just ape guys. Um, right now they they are like at three point six, um, and it's like ten sales to get to four point five or five Solana. Um, they're having like twenty to three sales a day. So for a week, I think that's achievable. And percentage wise, that's like a thirty percent if that happens, right? Um, I don't see them going much lower. I see a, a more opportunities for them to to go up a bit. Um, but there's no there's nothing um, backing this up. It's just the, the the position right now where they're at. They're really close to their all time low, right? So um, since someone else already called the 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 tattoo guys, um, I'm calling the 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 just tapes. The just tape, three point six four. Uh, yeah, the Uriah took the tattoo. There was no hesitation. Like I couldn't even shoot the, the intro before Uriah took uh, grabbed the, the tattoo guys. So that was a you had no chance there, Peter. But uh... <laughs> that's fine. Um... Yeah, those those are, are are good calls too. Right, just said yeah. Uh, these guys they went up to like ten just not long ago. Now seeing like three point six four, but I don't see that much. Just you, Peter. Yep, yep. And uh, uh, like I said, there's nothing right now backing them up because everybody who who uh, was able to stake is staking, just waiting for. For drop, and um, they they're gonna have a bump probably starting next season, but that's still like a month away. So, um, no actual news, just the the current position where they're at. That's it. Let's see. Um, we're gonna beat the pod team. It's gonna beat just a team in a Fortnite tournament. I think it's this week. I don't know. This week or next week. We're gonna. Fuck them up, just it. So uh, that might uh, decrease the floor price a little bit. But uh, when TK headshots them, but, uh, we'll see. Right, I think all the people on stage have made their calls. We are also going to do honorable mentions. I know Future had something. But before that, I want to know if anyone listening has anything to share. You have. Nothing to lose apart from a three-minute speech, and you have a Tokyo Saints to win. Uh, Tony, I never, you never secured your call. Are you going to secure it, or are you just going to leave the throne to Toasty again? I uh, uh, sorry, Sesti, Sesti. heard his call. If he can't come up, um, Tony, if you can give me an email, and I'd say it for you. If you can't come up, but we cannot just have. Hey, it, it has to be more than two seconds. Oh, well, I can't make any. I don't know anything about it. I um, think he said the Panthers, just, right? So, yeah, the Panthers, that is what he said. One without the H. The yeah, Panthers, 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 let's go. But this yeah, is going to be the cheapest, uh, cheapest call of the week. Point two four. Tony, you could win with this. If, if you don't come up, I'm going to let someone else come up, take your call, and win the prize. All right, Tony. All right, Tony. Leave it. Leave it. Uh, who else? Loss and hype. 15 mins. Oh my god, Tony. Do you think we have? All right. So we have 15 mins until uh, Tony is going to make his re call. Uh, Loss or, or hype um, or Puma or Sarah. Sarah, maybe should I let Sarah call a H bar project? Or is that unfair? Hmm. I'd allow it. Sarah, if you have any Aptos, Ethereum, Solana, or ETH calls, or projects, just in general, you, have, uh, you can drop something. Otherwise, you might get the opportunity to drop h -Bot. Even though we don't even know the name of the marketplace, wallet, or if this chain actually exists, or if it's a, a, just a thing people like to add on their name. 
technically not a blockchain, it's a cash grab. So, a cash grab. No, not a cash grab. <laughs> a hash grab. <laughs> a hash grab, please. Yeah, he said a cash grab. I love that. That was perfect. <laughs> sorry, Sarah. Sorry, Sarah. I know you have an AK. I don't want to. I don't want to mess with you too much. Should we let this Tony go, or should we just drop the Panthers? All right, guys, you 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 are the ones eligible to win this. To me as well, but. You're gonna have to to uh, vote if Tony has to make some more explanation to this call, or if he's able to win the this by just saying Panthers, nothing else. They're already up from when he first called them. Are they? <laughs> well, since he hasn't officially announced it, I say he called that top four price for him. Go ahead and give him that a uh, disadvantage. And because I'd like to see anybody beat Zesty since he's kind of undefeated since we started this Alpha Tuesday thing. So I'm down to take any and all um, choices. So he goes down. I'm giving you a real chance with my pick. Sure, the thing is, sure, the thing is, I think these Panthers could win because they are so cheap. Like, imagine what it would take for God to outperform Panthers, both of them pop. That's to be a lot more liquidity. In the D gods, not really. I mean, if the D gods go up over 300, that's up 35 soul opposed to up one or two soul. All right, we might let him, we might let him go, we might let him go. But before we let Tony Bet call his Panthers, I want to hear what Lost Soul is looking at that could possibly win him a Tokyo Saint next week. Maybe, maybe not. Give me oh, one, 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 one second, one second, guys. We'll just start our work. Um, so, I want to call it this is project, work. but I'll just make it quick since I'm right now at work. One, lost you, lost one, oh. one per person, one per person. Ooh. So you have to pick the best one. Okay, so I can only be one. So, okay, so I'll go with uh, Soul City, Gen Two. That just launched today. All right. Trying to find it there. Soul City. Gent. Uh, 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 there are 0. 0.53 right now. Soul City. Gen 2. Is this a... Uh, is it Donkeys? Yes, yeah. They're the Gen 2s from the uh, Soul City poker. All oh, right, so tell us, uh, do you have any info on this? Well, it's the second generation... It's the second collection from uh, Soul City Poker Club. Um, there's no uh, revenue share with this one. However, um, there's a lot of other um, other tools that come with it. Let's just say uh, there's awards to be won that you can win weekly. You can play in their participate in their tournaments. Um, there's ed some educational classes that they're doing for anybody that's interested to learn about how to play poker on a professional level. So there's some value that they're bringing with this uh, Gen 2. So I'm just calling it because I think They'll do well on just like their first collection. How, do you know how how good did the first collection do? You know? Yeah, I think they're for price around twenty six, twenty seven. Oh shit! I haven't seen like we haven't seen any really successful poker uh, NFT projects. So it would be cool to see if these guys have because it would be so nice to just go and play poker with our Solana, like sit and go, not sign up to tournaments and stuff. Yeah, I think they, they have it. They, they have that option on their uh, server. If you just go into the Discord, Discord, and then they have a website, you can go on and just play. Soon enough on play.goblingames.io. But that that's just a rumor. I have to see it with my own eyes first. All right, Soul City, Yen 2, 0.529, Zolami. Nice one, loss. Let's see this makes you... Beat Zesty in the butt. Oh, what did Zesty call? What's what's Zesty's call? He he have won three times. So and what he called, was he's called today? The sun. So I can buy. Oh wow. Okay. All right. I like it. Should have went for a super cheap one and just go and sweat it before before we. Hmm. Yo, the uh, 
because uh, I'm gonna lose service. The honorary one that I was gonna give out for cheap cheaper entry. It's still three plus soul. But this is the project I was bullish on before they even minted, and they've been out on secondary for about, mm, I'd say, two months, maybe closer to three. Yeah, I can't really recall exactly when they minted, but um, I minted this project, uh, been holding, and recently I've seen a huge uptick in tweets from the page itself. Uh, the project is called Cyberlinks. Uh, it's all one word, uh, C-Y-B-E-R-L-I-N-X. Um, Cyberlinks is doing a real deal revenue share. I actually just got my first payment. And from my understanding, I believe each Cyberlinks you hold gives you 0.04 a week. So it doesn't sound like much, but you also could buy their batteries for, I think the batteries have been sitting right around one soul, like 0 0.8, 0 0.9. Um, and that actually 1.25x is your weekly payout. So um, I do think that they have um, a pretty decent thing going there. Their website is super clean. The, um, the games that they have, they were innovative enough to create their own um, it's a it's a coin it's a it's a coin flip, but they call it Lucky Circle. So they actually created their own lucky circle, you know, flip game, and basically you either choose uh, you either choose green or pink, I believe it is. It's one of the two. So you have the option of either one, and instead of flipping a coin to see if it's heads or tails or whatever personalized logo, it's actually uh, a certain color. So they were innovative enough to kind of think outside the box and they made something that was original <clears throat> uh but like i said <clears throat> sorry <clears throat> i've been feeling under the weather for a while um but yeah like their website is super clean uh i know they're saying something about like integrating music and the music that they had on their website initially that i heard i was like a fan of and it was kind of tech techno uh, but i don't listen to techno and I was really digging one of the songs. I think it was track number one. It was like the first thing that played when you got on their website, but yeah. So they have like their slots. So they have a bunch of different games, you know, um, but yeah, their rev share has been doing solid. Um, and every single Monday you see, you know, 20, 50 tweets coming out about some people that one guy said he's gotten paid out 12 souls within the first month of owning them, you know, it's like they were all right around one soul right before this, these payouts started happening. So Cyberlinks is definitely uh, something that is a cheap enough buy to where as long as those uh, passive income payments keep coming, you know, three, it's, it's, I think it went down to 3.3. .3. You might even be able to put some offers out for under three or just at three soul. So three, six, nine, you spend less than 10 soul and every week you'll get point one, you know, you spend nine soul, you'd be getting point one, what, point one six, so almost point two uh, every single Monday. And, you know, it's, it's definitely something just for buying in and holding, uh, you have to lock it for 15 days. Um, otherwise you're not eligible. I found that out the hard way. I seek them. I didn't get a payment. I was like, well, these guys are lying. But no, they weren't. You know, like, they were like, you got to lock it. So, All yeah. Right. Well, but, Cyber link from future. So, as is yeah, that was just my honorary one. Yeah. So, Tony, you're with us now. Oh, shit. I, I just put another biscuit in. I was like, oh, shit. I got three more five minutes. All right. So, <laughs> look, this is Panthers. Panthers. There is a problem within this ecosystem. And I think this is the thing. Um, When investing, invest in disruptive technology. Okay. Disruptive technology always pushes you more. It always gives you exponential gains because it's a technology that everybody needs and everybody's dependent on. Um, and what I'm seeing with Panthers is they, it's not they are building, it's not they want to, it's they have disruptive technology. They have a platform that allows anybody to walk in and register on their platform as an alpha caller, like what we're doing right now. Now, you make your alpha call, you submit it, and people can see your alpha calls and they can react to them. They can press, I'm going to buy. They can press, 
Um, I want, I wish I could buy, but I don't have the funds to buy. And they can also press, I'm going to fade this. You then call an exit price as well. So you say, I'm entering at this price. This is your exit price. All of that goes down. If the transaction is successful, that person who made the call gets positive points. Okay, this is all on chain. It's tracking them. So the minute the collection gets to that price, the API no matter didn't report the floor price they called on chain. This is on chain. This is why this is disruptive. It gives that alpha caller a credit and it ranks them. So what ends up happening is you end up with this. This is not, they're not building this. They're not thinking of building this. It's available today, right now. The website's complete. It's ready to go. So that alpha caller gets their, um, their points added to their track record. So what's going to end up happening after three or four months, because this technology is going to, like AI, it's going to get better with volume, okay? So the more alpha calls are made on here, or the more people are using the platform, the more data we have to go by. And then you can start saying, oh, snap, that guy's got 46 calls correct in the last 18, 18, 18 weeks. Or the last four weeks, he's got 12 alpha calls um, correct. And this is how many exits he made on that. So it will give you those kind of numbers. And it's also cool because you can tip the alpha caller. If you, you know, you make a bag with them, you can drop them 0 0.2, 0 0.3, whatever you want to do. Um, all of that is already inbuilt. All of that is already functional. I think this is going to be an interesting point here where projects start asking these alpha callers they're employing in their programs, what's your score? What's your score? What's your score? Um, so for me, I think Panthers is, is, a, is a sleeping giant um, at point two. I'm not letting you guys get away with the point two for point two is my call. I think it's a good buy. Once the community tools they're putting forward and people start being, um, stop being scared and start looking for alpha, point two is a good entry. <laughs> All right, I'll let you free on the point two uh, because I saw that it thumped during this basis. That's always when someone names a project. No, I'm joking. But uh, interesting, uh, did you say, are they going to have a token as well? Or it's more like credibility so you can see that this is my track record? Yeah, so they're going to have, um, they're going to have like, a, like, um, I don't, I don't, like points. They're going to receive like points that show their track record. So when that individual makes a call, you know how successful they are, you know how unsuccessful they are, and it just gives you that confidence to kind of ape in with them. Mm, that is indeed interesting for point two. Point two four right now. So I'm, I'm looking at these Panthers. You know, they got a lot of the BVD traits, like the tile skin. There's a yellow and red jacket that BVD has in theirs as well. What did they release? It's the same artist. What is the mint price of um, The official mint price is 0.6. Um, they know yeah. They look, yeah, the, the official mint price was 1.25. It's 0.6. Um, the reason for the, for the floor price being so low is the team is a little bit slow to start, a little bit slow to market. They're also... Um, the team is publicly lowering morale by commenting negative statements in their announcements. Things such as um, remarking about the that's of Aptos being a, a downgrade for them, remarking about, um, but all that's about to change. All that's about to change. I like this. I think you have a good shot with this because it's what point two is already pumping, and a point four could be a hundred percent increase, which probably would beat most of the calls here today. Um, it's like it sounds like they got some interesting stuff coming. As is this platform live? You know that. Yeah, yeah. The mobile version is coming out soon, but they've got a desktop version. Just um, obviously log on, connect with your banner, and you can um, you can check out. There's already alpha calls being made on there. Um, it's pretty good. I think. Uh, do, and they need an to get access. At the moment, not at the moment. You can get access to the general dashboard. But um, as this, and that's the thing, we're going to talk some about it. Um, as this project rolls out a little bit more, um, they want to kind of gate the the alpha. So you need an NFT to access the alpha calls. Um, but yeah, I, I think they need to kind of open that a little bit more, uh, make it more inclusive. I think the team's quite young. They still need a little bit more molding and stuff. Um, once they get their bearings um, after this week, uh, I think they'll start taking some strides. You know, just, just the right advice, you know, like how to promote it, how to get people on board, ETC, all that kind of stuff. Um, because it's, it's one of those things that are utility, but nobody's using it. Um, so that kind of reflects in the value. 
I like I actually like or prefer when projects have, as you said, it open for everyone, but to get the reward, you know, you have to be a holder. Because that opens up to so much more exposure. And yeah, that's a limit. If you build something good for the ecosystem, everyone can use it. Um, but you need the NFT to get the rewards. I like that. Right. <laughs> we don't have uh, thank you, Tony. Don't have uh, we just secured that call. We don't have anyone else on stage who haven't made a call yet. Um, if anyone else has any calls, we're gonna uh, this is gonna run. We're gonna call something now. Uh, check back next week, and the one that made the best call can stay. Token. I've got some runners up if we have time, Adam. Yeah, I don't you know if anybody else. Honorary. Are we still doing runners up? Honorary mention. I think uh, TK, uh, yeah, TK actually mentioned him earlier. He was a little torn between them. Um, real quick, briefly, most of y'all know, Chain Breakers, definitely honorable mention. Um, with everything that's going on in the ecosystem, we already know Marketplace is on its way. So is he cutting out? Yeah, uh, hang on, hang on. I think what he was saying, Hello? Shane Breaker. Yeah. Yep. Can you hear, you? Can you hear me now? Hello. My bad. I got a yes. call yep. right as I was starting. All right. So, Chain Breakers, for sure. We already know the dev is working. Uh, multi chain coming soon. Even take, I mean, I, nothing in stone, right? But with words coming out of the dev's mouth, we're going to Ethereum for sure. Uh, Aptos is another chain that we're looking at. Um, chain Breakers is attached to Hyperlaunch. Could you imagine? The launches, the NFT projects launching on all three chains, moving very quickly with everything that's going on. Marketplace still getting worked on. A um, lot of big things coming. We've got protocols coming. We already know that. Super low floor price right now. Time to get in. Load up. Um, an honorable mention that I have is Buddies. Art upgrade. Come in. They've got the coffee line. They've been in the game. Everybody's about coffee. They have that IRL. Yes, it's funny, but they've got legitimacy here they've got income coming in in pretty low floor price again art upgrade coming in uh bongus which is the founder that man's in spaces all the time hopefully we're going to get him on the pod soon enough uh so he can speak about his own project as well but honorable mention currently at uh 0.65 floor price i think uh very thin floor um nice they made any sneak peeks on the art upgrade. that not yet that i've seen personally but i know they're coming this is uh, a good one. And again, uh, Bongus has not quit spaces in them. We're going to get them on the pod. Um, yeah, just another alpha call you want to take a look at. Again, thin floor, uh, very low entry. Um, something you might be able to kind of swing trade back and forth. Good stuff. Oh, um, I'm sorry to be, I'm going to be one of those airport people. I'm about to leave. Um, I'm just heading to a call with... Um, the the devs at Panthers. All right, catch you later. I'll join in, Tony. I'll see you there. Perfect, Tony. Pump that floor price because I saw Seth just bought one. Two. Two, sorry. Uh, Shame Breakers, uh, I think this is announced. I think, uh, I think, I know Jack is planning to make the launch pad fully automated this week. Um, if that's going to be delayed or not, we don't know, but that is the plan. So, definitely. Good. Share. I thought someone would call Chain Breakers, but uh, we didn't. Or you mentioned it, but as the play. It's all going to depend on if, if, if they get that stuff out this week. I think I was going to call them next week. I'm going to go ahead and make my call for next week, Chain Breakers. You cannot. You cannot. Uh, but you'll get to call it next week once the floor I'm going to go ahead up. and say, say I call first next week then. I'll go ahead and put that put that out there. Co-host gets first call next week. All right. That's good. That's good. All right. Uh, we have no more... Nope. No more people that haven't shown any place on stage. I think we'll cut it. Um, the Euphoria spaces is a little bit... I'm going to go make this thread. Uh, we'll see if someone open a space if you want to. Uh, otherwise, we'll do the Euphoria. One later, we have, let me check what we have, have, have called. Meta Tattoo, Community 3, Kets, BSL, V Gods, Descendants, Youths, Ghost Kid, Just Ape, Soul City, Gen 2, and 
Panthers. Hmm. Let's see who wins this Tokyo Saints. Perfect. Right. I'm going to play your song today, Future. Your honorary uh, song that you wanted to play last week that I didn't. Sorry, but it's coming today. Um, if anyone missed anything happening today, we're also on all the streaming platforms. So you can listen back. And I'll also make, as I said, a thread on all the polls we made so we can keep track. Uh, no one, everyone called Solana for me, so that's good. Then I don't have to cross check the, the, uh, the USD price of these tokens. I can just go off Solana. Thanks, everyone, for coming on. Hope you had a great time. Tomorrow, what day is it? Tomorrow, Wednesday. What's happening on Wednesday, TK? Um, I'm sure we're going to do a calendar. Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, I'm sure sure we'll be here. Same time, same place, you know. Oh, shit. I know what's happening tomorrow. We're going to talk age bar, dude. What the heck? Oh here? yeah! Tomorrow's the big H bar day. We've got some uh, some good H bar guests to follow. If you are an H bar, you're wanting to learn anything about H bar. The person we have coming on tomorrow is legit in the H bar space and has grown and made that space better and continues to work there. So if you really have any interest in learning what H bar is about tomorrow. Um, either join in live or listen to the recording because um, Patches is going to be with us tomorrow. It's going to be epic. Well, let's go. Yeah, I don't know nothing about this, so I'm curious to see if this actually is something. Um, you can actually do something on HMR. Let's see. Perfect. All right. We had a. This was, I think, no, it's not the first time we gave away an NFT. One of you. Let's get some more giveaways going. I like, I like this. You don't want some shit. See you guys just here standing out with us every day. Um, perfect. Shout out to Hyperlaunch for sponsoring us as always. Building a permissionless launch plan that, as we said, is going to be fully automated, hopefully by Sunday, um, where you can launch your NFT collection without writing a single line of code. Very good pricing. And your uh, NFT page is fully customizable. So I guess on Sunday you'll be able to go in there and and get it however you want to. You can't do it today, but it has now it's in beta, so you have to do it a uh, little bit manual with the founder Jack and his developer Superman. But um, soon you can do it all by yourself. Put whatever you want on there since it's permissionless. All right, Euphoria. As I said, a little bit late today, but feel free to open a space. I'll be there after I make this long thread and all your uh, place. Till next time. And thanks for coming on. This song I'm going to play right now is Future's honorary song that goes to the entire Magic Eden team. So if you connect the dots, you'll hear what this song is about. But shout out to, to, to Magic Eden with this song. See you guys. Yeah, yeah, we can hear it. Oh, fuck, I could. All right. Uh, uh, see you guys. This is a bit slow. How can I sing this? I just want to sing. Woo! Oh, 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 oh. Give me what it is on the stage. And I'll turn right back around.
up, turn right back around. I said I don't wanna leave you alone. You gotta make me change my mind. See you guys.